All right. Hi, everyone. Uh, a little something different tonight. Well, let's see. Last night was creative, right? That's right. How could I forget? Six hours to the center. Hey, Katsina. Uh, tonight, I'm going to do survival. Uh, same as permadeath, except death's not permanent. But I'm trying out two mods. Um, I couldn't find a damage mod. We, what I really want is I want increased damage to player. Increased stack size, because the stack size limitation takes a lot of the fun out of both permadeath and uh, survival. I wish they had a weight. Hey, Fuzzball, how's it going? Lord Stork, how you doing? I wish they had a weight uh, inventory system so that you could, you know, manage how much you were carrying. But they don't. So it's a stack size times five. So what is that? Uh, 250 goes to uh, 250, 500. Yeah, 1250. And 500 goes to 2,500. There's math. 5 times 5 is 25, though. And then no random loot. So you'll still have loot next to buildings, but you won't have the piles of loot just laying out in the middle of nowhere. I thought that might be interesting because that could increase difficulty, uh, maybe. But I really want to increase damage to the player. I really want to make it brutally hard. Maybe it's just me. But it doesn't seem too brutally hard. But anyway, uh, that's the mod we're playing with. And I'm going to do survival because there's no way... I'm not touching my... This is my other permadeath save. Uh, I'm not doing permadeath with uh, with these kind of mods loaded. So we're going to do survival. Just cross your fingers that they work. Cross your fingers, put your hands on the TV set, all that stuff. Alright, so my rules are, are simple. Uh, if in the first... Uh, if in the first two minutes... Uh, either I die or I just don't like the start because there's no cave and no way to protect myself. We just simply start over. <clears throat> it's hot. And there's a cave right in front of me. That I may or may not be able to get into. It looks like I should be able to squeeze into that. It is 161 degrees. Oh, it's toxic. Uh, I never know how to read that toxicity. I love starting up, I tell you. I don't know. I don't know why it's so much fun. It just, just this is a thrill. Just to get, just, just the very start of the game. See a fuzzball acute. Lutravine. Sounds like an energy drink. What's this really bright thing here? Nothing. Alright, can we get in the cave? It is heat. And there is a cave. Alright, so that's good. Uh, let's take care of some business here. Um... Utilities, toggle camera view with the control 2, and utilities, no, 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 camera, control 9, there we go, all is right with the world, uh, let's start a scan, we can't, the scanner's critically damaged, we need some ferrite, uh, ooh, we'll get some of this first, go, go away. So there'll be a check of the... Okay, I'll get some cobalt. But what I really need is uh, ferrite dust. Sometimes you get lucky and a cave has ferrite in it. These are plants. That's interesting. Are these little sticks? These are plants too. And that's cobalt. Alright, let's, uh, let's peek outside a minute. And try to get some ferrite dust. Yeah, an advanced mining laser. Advanced mining laser. There we go. More bad plants right to the right of me. Alright, I can fix the scanner. 
get a little more ferrite dust for reasons. Overheat, all right, fine. Sodium, nice. Get out of my face. All right. Let's fix this. I can now scan. Uh, what do I need to do? What do I need to fix this? Oh, wait. Let's do this really quick. Let's get, since these are plants here. Uh, let me get some carbon real quick. Why did it trigger the Stark song? What did I do? What did I do? I didn't do anything. I'll have you know. Oh, because I got in the cave and it recharged my hazard protection? Oh, well, we get to listen to the music. Yeah, good thing I was uh, doing the carbon. So I've, I've said this before, usually at the beginning. They actually dim, they, they quiet down the uh, game sound in favor of the music. So... It'll be hard to hear some of the tools and stuff until this song ends. Which I think is pretty cool. Alright, let's uh let's blow this popsicle stand. Uh do I have any inventory over two fifty yet? No. So we have we have not tested the mod yet. But there should be not be any stray boxes sitting around anywhere. Should just be a desolate landscape, bad guy. Oh, I need to make some carbon nanotubes. Right, so for my scanner. Uh, scanner. Uh, e. Uh, you shouldn't be doing this outside. But, um, E. Analysis visor requires a carbon nanotube. Can I make one? Yep. We got it. Here we go. Perfect. All right. There is still damaged machinery, so. Oh, that's slow. Alright, the ship's not too far away. I think I forgot to talk there for about five minutes, because I like I really like this music. Blue things. Didn't take damage.
Oh, I missed some uh, damaged machinery. I talked about it and then I went right by it. So I should have over 250 ferrite dust. I lied. Oh, a storm crystal. 135. I don't have over 250 anything yet. Man. So if you look on the, the various mod pages for No Man's Sky, you can see that there were increased damage mods back in as recent as 2019, but nobody's updated them. And that, I, I don't know whether they were moved like it can't be modded or they didn't work right or what, but I, uh, I just think I, in, in, in survival or permadeath, uh, playing uh, the way I'm playing right now, I probably should be dead. Uh, it should be much more difficult. Let's get in here. Iteration 4924G online. Atlas connection intermittent. Launch thrusters offline. Pulse engine offline. I find myself alone in a strange world. But this ship seems to recognize me. Read log. Log 4925A, substituting data. Pilot should perform maintenance. Self-repair protocols initiated. All right, yeah, it's critically damaged. Uh, let's see, what do we need? Uh, we need a metal plating, which I can make one of. But I can't make that blasted hermetic seal. Oops, I was there. <gasps> Cannot build missing components. Uh, let's tear apart the rocket launcher right now. And then with this, uh, let's make a dihydrogen jelly. And uh, we'll put that in there. And then we need pure ferrite. Okay. Did I break the world? I broke something. There. Alright, let's read this. While it's catching up. Broadcast. Broadcast receive. So, I repaired the pulse engine with the metal plating. Board the starship. There we go. Uh, starship critically damaged, vital ingredient min missing, unable to synthesize required components, one hermetic seal. Request assistance. Distress beacon save planetary charge from the distress beacon cache. Uh, it's still catching up. Now look sharp when I do this to see if we can see any cool buildings nearby. Here we go. Uh, I see ships. I see where we're going. I don't see anything else. That's a shame. Alright. No, that's fine. And a storm will be starting soon. We could really use some uh, sodium. Uh, there's some up the hill. Uh, there's some over there. So let's get this batch first. Uh, any bad guys nearby? There are some bad guys nearby. Let's get in the cave and then get them. Maybe this gives us some sodium. It doesn't. Oops, forgot one. Oh, uh, can I scan you? No. Sodium? What do you say? Nope. Oxygen. There's sodium. More sodium. This is good. 
Oh, that's right, the storm. How could I forget? Alright, well, we'll try to go anyway. Where am I going? Over this way? Sure. Sodium over here. Damaged machinery. Out of gas. Overshoot. Classic. Uh, where did that damaged machinery go? Here it is. I believe I'm safe inside this menu, which is kind of cheaty. I'll grab this. Nothing happening. Mining beam. Good choice. So I'll need a cave if I'm going to survive. Scanner's still recharging. There's some sodium down the hill. Now if I die, I have to restart the game. Because, oh no, 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 I saved in the ship. That's right. There's two things I need, so we're gonna pick this up. We'll take some damage. Yeah, 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 we're fine. Everything's fine. Right into the plant. We gotta get on the other side of this crap. Yep. Looks like we're gonna make it. But there were no goodies, goodie boxes anywhere in between. Just damaged machinery. Which is cool. Accessing archive. No one making this recording in case, leaving behind in the fabricator might be of some use. Visor damaged, can't find ship. Recover supplies. I get my two hermetic seals. No, I just get one. Ooh, I'm rather unlucky. I've been getting two for the longest time. Your health, right? I don't think I'm losing any health. No, no health loss. I can't spin this chair? What? 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 Man. Uh, oh. Uh, mm, this should work. Learn the Gek word for Gek. Now this should work. I was wrong. Oh well, I can't get any standing with the Gek until I've actually met a Gek. I'm supposed to use the analysis visor to scan for the ship. There's the ship. Uh, let's scan something. And uh, we, we scanned these little plants before. Let's get some carbon. Alright, any inventory above 250 yet? Close. So close. Uh, what was that? Ferrite dust. We need some more ferrite dust. Get out of my face. Out. I'm just scan this. Ferrite dust and phosphorus. Phosphorus is good for the shield. Uh, if I ever get a shield. 
This is my home planet, so... Alright, ferrite dust is now at 270. We've broken the 250 barrier. Yay. Alright, uh, I think fireweed... Um, increases, uh, restores hazard protection. I'm not sure about that. I'm gonna check it out. After I get these blue things. Never jetpack downhill. Somehow I made it. Alright, let's get the fire fire berry, not fire weed, sorry. And then let's eat these. No, this is oxygen. See it replenishing the oxygen? And then whoop 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 whoop. Alright, well. I need sodium then. Any scan? Oh, there's a few over there. Sure, I'll go that way. Bad plant. One giant. Oh, there's another one in here somewhere, isn't there? It's still glowing. Must be just my visor. There's oxygen. I don't see any sodium. I think the planet does look a lot neater without the uh, scattered boxes of uh, loot everywhere. It gives me a much uh, a much more immersive feeling that I'm on a planet. Those loot boxes are just crazy. I really like this. Blue things. Blue things. Give me all the blue things. I know, I overheated the weapon. Alright. Three hundred fifty-eight. Good. I think. What did I say the cap was going to be? Five twenty-five. No. Fifteen. Twelve fifty. Right. Let's get. I don't see any sodium anywhere. So let's get these blue plants. And then he finds sodium. Well, there's another blue plant. I hurt myself. And then it's carbon. We're almost there. Don't worry about it. It's we're almost out. It's okay. Can I make it? Phew. Doesn't look like a junkyard. Yeah. I, I like it a lot. Um, the older version, it was just updated a few days ago. The version prior to this had a hard crash when you tried to expand freighter inventory, so... We must be cautious with this mod, but right now it looks awesome. All right, so I got the hermetic seal. I can repair it. All right, that's done. I need to make some pure ferrite. Uh, I already put the hydrogen jelly in it, so uh, maybe you weren't paying attention. Uh, but I'm way ahead of you. Uh, oh, I need a another uh, metal plating, please. 
There we go. And uh, we'll put in uh, some fuel, and we'll put in some ferrite dust. I forget how much to have. 51's fine. It's gonna make 51 pure ferrite. How much do I actually need? Uh, 50. Alright, so I'm gonna make 51. I have one extra. It's okay. 51. Pick it up. We're good to go. Have I gotten everything out here? Since there's not very many loot boxes on the planet, let's uh, pick up what we can. Dihydrogen, damaged container. I'm gonna toss the rusted metal. I don't care. Sodium nitrate, not that useful this early. I didn't get this? Whoa. How about a thermal protection module? Oh. Oh. Really? What are the odds? All right, I'm I'm so excited, and I just can't hide it. Uh, yeah, so, um, so I got this thing, which is exactly what I needed, so scooch out of the way, and uh, actually you go back to here, and you, that's crazy. Now the problem is, I'm going to need either batteries or what little phosphorus I have, and I don't have much. Uh, I have seven. But still... Shield is on. How come it's not registering? There it goes. Let's recharge the oxygen. <laughs> you think that you think that helped, eh? Uh, all right, I think I'm ready to get out of here. Um, that is, yeah, I think I am. Yeah, let's get up in the ship. All systems functional, seek answers amongst the stars. Uh, in a minute. So there's where we were, boy, that seemed like much further away than that. Telephone booth. There's another mod that removes damaged machinery, but damaged machinery is too much fun. I don't mind damaged machinery. Um, I can see where people want, would want it gone too, but already without all the loot boxes everywhere, it seems more realistic. I know I'm repeating myself. It also seems very, very dark. <laughs> why, why is it so dark? Nighttime usually isn't even this dark, but it's almost daytime, so. What the heck? This is a telephone booth central here. Anything up the hill that I'm missing? No? Oh, I know what. Oh, what's this? What's this? It's nothing. Well, loot boxes. Uh, let me uh, let me handle this thing. Utilities control two. All right. A little easier to see. Maybe. Oh yeah, I probably should head due north. Alright, well, 
we can head to the next planet. What the heck is that? Oh, it's a plant on top of this, just this ridge. I think I'm gonna like this planet for a home planet. It's, it's not super mountainous, so it's not really difficult to get around on. There we go, another unknown building. Hey, Ricky, how you doing? Your name is Green. Is that what I think? No, it's not. It's just another... Yeah, I don't know. I don't know why it's identifying those as buildings. Maybe it's this mod has messed up the scanner somewhat. Ah, uh, yes. That's what we're talking about. Land. Land. Land now. Land now. Do not argue with me when I say land. Land. That's what we're talking about. All right, we get to find a minor settlement. And there's some health here. And one of these. Just what I wanted. Minor settlement, excellent. Okay, against my better judgment. Sodium nitrate again. Wow. I'm going to put some oxygen. What I really need is just plain sodium. This is a problem. Good. <laughs> What do I need for this? Metal plating. Okay, let's make a few metal... Oops. Let's make, uh... Three... Four... I can only make three? Really? I have that little ferrite. I've been mining ferrite. I don't want to talk about it. Alright, how far away is this minor settlement? Kind of, sort of far. What are the odds of me finding one before we get there? As I have done numerous times in the past. What is that? Is that nothing again? Yeah, it seems to find... I don't know. I'm tired of guessing. Yeah, it's finding these random... It's like loot boxes are showing up in the scanner now. That might be due to this mod. Who knows? Anyway, let's get to this minor settlement. It's the hubbub gra system. Oh yeah, I, I gotta do things since I'm up here. Uh, w... What do you think? You got it? You got it? There's the W. Come on, I'm testing. Yep, space for the pulse engine. We've already done this. Okay. Of course. Please identify yourself. Identify yourself. You are not alone. Follow the broadcast ends as strangely begins. Planetary coordinates. Bingo. We're not going there though. We're going to this minor settlement.
Barring any massive discoveries, this is where I'll put the first base. It's a B-class. Uh, that's pretty darn decent for a B-class. And we'll have to see what's in the space station. But that's pretty darn decent, in my opinion. Uh, there's the wall. There's some navigation data. And this is a GEC system. Nice hat. Mm-hmm. Yep, can't do any of that. Got 43 nanites. Can't really do anything here, but I marked it for now. And let's go back here. I'm gonna need more ferrite. Dust. Point. Heck, 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 heck. I could identify these, you know. Does that need the... It does not. There's some phosphorus, a little bit of it. Yeah, you know, it would be really convenient to have that advanced mining laser, I tell you. And if you stumble into nanites, somehow, you can get it. You can just buy it from that guy. Alright, let's continue the quest. Well, no, no, no. Let's do this. Starship launch field. Hey, you know what? I'll take it. I'll take it. I don't understand why I can't spin those chairs. They're broke. I've met a Gek, therefore... I failed at the Gek standing still. I've learned the word for friend, though. Let's continue with the quest. So one of these days I'll try this speed run to the anomaly. I've been reading about people trying it and uh, it's... I know I'll fail miserably the first couple of times because I always get distracted. What is that? Wait, yeah, there's only one quest so you can't... No matter how hard you try to switch quests on me, you can't. Whoa. What have we here? What is the little black? What is the little dot? That's what I thought. I'll check out the space station real quick. Cool looking planet. There's also a mod where you can get rid of the the, uh, the lines, the uh, trade route lines. But supposedly it's not working correctly since this latest update. Are you not in the... Let's see... Maybe over... Easy now. Maybe over here. I think I've, I've failed to find the entrance. Over here. Here it is.
So the only reason to visit the space station this early is so that when you do the initial base quest and then it wants you to visit the space station, you can just teleport there. And the signal source is on the same planet, so back we go. Lutravine Omega. Dietary supplement. side of the planet appears to be a tad more mountainous. What do you got for me? Sparking wires of the machine generate a signal tapping on its broadcast into the void. Decipher signal. Decoding, 161616. 16, 16. Entry, no fuel in, failed to reach station, hazard protection low, no choice but to underground, deployed base computer. As well as the log entry, the signal contains a plan for a base computer and a terrain manipulator. Extract the plans. Excellent. All right. Uh, let's see. Uh, yeah, what do we need for the terrain manipulator? Uh, two carbon nanotubes and some dihydrogen jelly. Two carbon nanotubes and a spot of dihydrogen jelly. Boom, boom, boom. Let's put you down here. Let's put you over here because you don't really line up with anything. And then we just have these, these guys. All right. And let's get this is good and that life supports low so hey let's eat the fireberry and, uh, and avoid using up some oxygen which we have how much oxygen I don't know but I have a storm crystal I could have sold for cash just saying and let's get our first berry technology module you know how I oh that was active you know how I love the train manipulator I'm an expert at manipulating the train it's a two spot and it's it's a bad omen let's get this and let's see I don't need health and once again I will get this against my better judgment what are you gonna give me A gek relic. I knew it. Alright. Uh, that's it. Let's go back and make the base. Where did I park? Up here. Oh. Uh oh. We're, we're fine. Yeah, can I, uh, re can I do the shield? With 23 phosphorus? Yeah. That's enough to do the shield. Alright. I still can't believe how lucky I got with that shield. I'm over the... Excuse me, I'm over the goop. More Starship launch fuel. Alright. Normally I hate it, but... Not today. Ooh, what's this? What is this? Look, what is that? Is that something? It looks like a building. Uh-huh. Not say anything. Alright. Let's turn around and just take a take a look. Wait, there's another building down here. They're all over the place. 
It would be nice. There we go. Oh, is this an abandon? Is this abandoned? No, I don't think so. Let's park. Oh, look at the green things. That's like uh, chlorine, right? Come on. Yeah, this is this is an abandoned warehouse. I don't want anything to do with this. All right, wait. Get this. Wow, these things rarely have microprocessors. That's cool. I'm gonna need it. Should I get the chlorine? I think I should. I got oxygen. Organic rock. Nice. Got to start somewhere. One more over here. Yep, bright light. Looks like there's one underneath this plant. Uh, let me analyze real quick. Alright, got some chlorine. Doo -doo -doo -doo. And then there's a building on the other side down the hill I might as well walk to. Although this guy, I got a lot of launch fuel. Let me just fly over it and see if it's worth anything. So it's right down the hill, right? Right around this. Don't hit the rock. Right on the other side? It is. See? And it's got a landy thing. This is an observatory. Where's the entrance? Here it is. So there is loot here I can get. Sodium. There are these chairs. want to locate a uh, ancient whatever it is so let's just get out of here Something else. Now this I'm going to say is an abandoned warehouse again. But then what is this? Is it the same combo? Ah. This is uh, this is something else. Yeah, that's got the secure door. I don't have a gun. So well, there you go. this. Aha! Uh -huh. 
Aha! Transmission tower. Get this first. I swear, just for a second, that chair worked. I swear it. Alright, we're not gonna do the. this. All right, who's here that can do the math? There's a dude here, I'm not talking to him. Long ago, automated distress signal if I crash, crack the encryption pattern. Uh, oh, I know this, right? Uh, one, two, six, 24, five times, uh, let's see, no, six times 24. One times two is two, two times three is six, six times four is 24. 24 times five is 120, 120 times six, 2 times 6 is 12. Uh, why can't I do this? Uh, 12 times 6. 5 times 12 is 60. 66. No, I'm getting it all wrong. Somebody give me an answer so I don't have to look like a fool, please. Uh, why can't I do this in my head? I can't stream and do this at the same time. It's 6 times 120. Uh... 720, thanks, Dragon. Why did, Why can't it? 72. Yeah, 6 times six times 12, 72. It's uh, multiplication tables. I think I need to restudy them. It's been too long. There's another building to the left. What'd you get? What did you get? You got... A distress beacon, nice. Did I get that? So the only one of those distress beacons that I legitimately can't get, and I don't know why I can't do math tonight, is uh, the one with the, is it the, the Fibonacci sequence? And man, that, that stumped me so bad. Luckily there was somebody on that was, uh, that knew it. I did these. I swear I did. I did. I didn't do the damage machinery. Um, yeah, how much phosphorus do I have now? Seven, about half charged. Where's the... There it is. Two again, so we're kind of stuck on two. Alright. So how far away is this? Four days. And then I'll do the base. Running a little bit behind. There goes the base.
don't see anything. I see something. Holler? Is there a dude walking around? No. Wow. Legit crash ship. Alright, what do we got? A C-40. 32 million. A C-40. Wow. The luck is with this dude. Let's see what we got here. I clamber into the cargo ship and find its black box. As soon as I touch it, a holographic image of a panicked reptilian trader appears. Perhaps it's a message for their superior, perhaps a loved one. It's impossible to tell as the playback is hauntingly silent. In his final moments, the trader seems to point at some freshly installed ship tech before dropping to its knees in despair. Inspect the recently installed ship tech or search for cargo. Hmm. I think tech. I discover the poorly installed tech that caused the crash. I scanned its blueprint because obviously it's going to work better for me. A teleport receiver. Great. I would have received it free anyway. Alright, fine. I'm not complaining. I'm just complaining. How about an S scanner upgrade? I asked too late. Maybe next time. Two again. Alright. Let me claim the ship. Ouch. Uh, yeah, it's, uh, it's pretty hideous. Claim it. And uh, let's get back in my ship and we'll just leave it there. And at some point I'll deal with it. Alright. Cool. And now let's go back to... How far away is this? Ten minutes. this now? That's another observatory? Yep. What was that? Just a beans load of oxygen and sodium. Alright. I'll bite. Very cool looking at night. Pick up the sodium. Really, I should um, get phosphate, you know what, for the shield. In which case, I won't really need all this sodium, but, you know, there's a lot of sodium here. 